For a very long time, I defined success incorrectly. I didn't have the best cars. I didn't own an expensive house. I wasn't the best programmer out there. I hadn't sold one gazillion copies worth of books. So, nothing qualified me to be a success. But success isn't viewed this way. If success is defined by what you have and not by who you are, then anyone who makes money through whatever schemes can be termed successful. But success is much more than that. If you're living your best life, having all that you need to enjoy a good life, making a positive impact on the world around you, echoing a value and personality that attracts and positively influences people, then you are successful. Success is often not in possessions. Success is in who you are and in who you are becoming. You may be successful and you do not know it. Here are nine signs you are successful, even though you may not be aware. One, you believe in the voice in your head more than other people's voices. It's not every time that someone refuses to give up his dreams. Most people give up great ideas and concepts just by ignoring the voice in their head to listen to the voices of other people. If you're not that kind of person who lets the negative voices of people drown your ideas, then you are successful. Others may doubt you. They may disparage and criticize you. You don't care. You go on to do what you know is right to do, even though it doesn't agree with dream killers. You acknowledge the opinion of others, yes, but you sift through them. You take what's useful and the rest you throw out of the window. You may respect the opinion of others, but you are not planning to live your life based on other people's opinion. You are successful or you are on your way to becoming successful. 2. You create choices. You don't make them. Others may choose between options A or option B. But successful people consider both options and then create their own option. As John Borgstone says, Every time you want to make an important decision, there are two possible courses of action. You can look at the array of choices that present themselves, pick the best available option and try to make it fit. Or you can do what the true entrepreneur does, figure out the best conceivable option and then make it available. If you can see what others aren't seeing and then you create your own choices based on that, you are successful or you are on your way to being successful. 3. You are no longer controlled by income. Money is important. We all know that. You need money to pay your bills. You need money to take care of certain expenses that are needful to move your life forward. Yet, at what cost are you willing to make this money? Would you give up a meaningful relationship with friends and family just to get rich? Or refuse yourself the option for good health just to stay up working nights and nights for money? Would you be sacrificing days of rest on the table of work just to get more money? Earning an extra income is beautiful. But when it takes your life away, it becomes dangerous. However, if you have complete control over how you make money and also still maintain some level of sanity in your life and relationships, you are successful. You just don't know it yet. 4. You don't seek praise. You work hard. You do your best. You go out of your way to deliver the best result on every job you do. Yet, you don't lose your head when you don't get the praise. As much as you love what you do, you don't live for the praises of other men. You have been able to define what success means to you and the value you place on work and good relationships rather than fighting to get the praises of men. If you don't get the praise of men, it doesn't affect your self-esteem because your self-esteem isn't built on what people say or think about you. If you're like this, you're successful. You just have been unaware of it. 5. You are always positive. Do you always see the bright side of life? No matter the amount of curveballs life throws at you, are you constantly seeing the light at the end of your tunnel even though you seem to have the world on your shoulder? Do people constantly come to you to support them emotionally because they know you always see the good in everything? If this describes you, you are successful. You just aren't admitting it to yourself yet. 6. You believe in the process, not in winning or losing. If you are on a journey towards success, you would rather fail on your own terms than succeed on someone else's terms. You aren't desperate to win. Neither are you fighting to lose. Win or lose, you are much more focused on your attitude, on who you are becoming, instead of focusing on what you will gain. Of course, you want to win. You are working to win, but you are much more driven by the process than the destination you are going to. But in winning, you don't miss the lessons you need in the process. You are successful. You just haven't admitted it yet. 7. You know that failure isn't forever. You have a good attitude towards failure. 
You know that the people who never fail are those who don't try. You don't think you're a failure because you have failed. You realize the real failures are those who stay down. You embrace each failure as an opportunity to learn something and then you move on. You've learned that true success comes only after several failures. So you welcome failure as a sign that you are on your way to succeeding. You let your mistakes pave the way for your success by showing you what you are doing wrong on your path to success. You often envisage your breakthroughs when you are feeling stuck or frustrated. If you are like these, you are successful. You just do not know it yet. 8. You keep things in perspective. It's nothing new or surprising when bad things happen. They are part of life. Some messy things you never planned for happen. You lose your car when you shouldn't. You fail an examination you were sure you would pass. A best friend betrays you. In all of these, you don't let them move you. If you have mastered the ability to keep your problems in perspective, then you are successful. You just haven't been seeing it that way. 9. You ask for help when you need it. Those who think they know it all always end up missing out on the best things in life. Their ignorance soon shows and they fall flat on their faces. But if no matter the success you achieve, you still learn to ask for help, refusing to believe that you are Mr. Know-It-All, you are successful. Refusing to ask for help, no matter how much you are struggling, is a sign of emotional immaturity. When you ask for help, you show you have nothing to prove by acting like you are perfect. It shows you are not afraid of people discovering your weaknesses and you cannot succeed alone. If this video inspired you, like the video. We love you.